Hey everybody, it's Tyler from Marketing Tea, and today I'm gonna teach you about the philosophy of SEO. So if you're a business owner, you're probably already familiar with SEO or search engine optimization. We get calls here all the time at Marketing Tea about how to manipulate search engine optimization and move your business to the top result of Google. But nine times out of 10, when someone calls us and wants to talk about SEO, we end up talking about proactive marketing. And that's what we're gonna talk about today. So at Marketing Tea, our philosophy is that your marketing should be proactive, not reactive. So SEO would fall on the reactive side of marketing, where something like social media and content marketing, that would fall on the proactive side. So essentially what we mean by this is that there's two ways for a consumer to find your business. Reactive would be what SEO falls under. That's when someone is gonna go to Google, type in a business like yours or your type of business, and then you hope to show up in the top results on that Google search. On the proactive side of things, that's when we reach a consumer even before they've thought about going to you for your business. So when we use content marketing and things like Facebook ads to reach out to people who might be interested in what you do, that's how we're being proactive and starting that relationship on that right foot. So instead of competing for the top spot on Google, someone has already found you, learned about your business, connected with you on another platform, say social media, and then they know exactly what to search for when they come to Google. Our favorite thing to see is that someone is searching for your name, not a business like yours on Google. So for example, let's think about how this works for marketing tea, because we apply the exact same strategy. So if you go to Google and type in marketing agency, I guarantee that marketing tea will not pop up in the top results. Our budget for something like Google AdWords or SEO is not nearly as high as the big boys who can pay a lot of money to be in those top spots. However, the playing field is much more even when we're talking about social media. We can create a video like this and show you something helpful for your business and reach you if you might be interested in the type of work that we do. By doing that, we've started the relationship, and that's exactly what our social media outreach is for. Once we've started that relationship, if you're interested in our services, it's as easy then as typing in the name Marketing Tea on Google, you'll find our website, you'll find our social profiles, you'll find a way to connect with us. So in the same exact way, we encourage all business owners to look to the proactive side of marketing, because here at Marketing Tea, that's our philosophy. The absolute, hands down, best way to build a relationship with a new potential client is to use proactive marketing. So there you have it, the Marketing Tea philosophy on proactive versus reactive marketing. I hope you think about this next time you're thinking about your SEO. And I'll add a caveat that SEO can be really important for certain types of businesses. So this is for those of you who are thinking about where to apply your marketing efforts best. 99% of the time, it's gonna come down to proactive marketing, and that's what we believe. If you're interested in getting started with proactive marketing, content marketing, and really seeing what you can do to build great relationships with potential clients, then reach out to us. We'd be happy to help set your business up with proactive marketing.